it costs rupees 2200 to paint the inner curved surface of a cylindrical vessel 10 meter deep if the cost of painting is at the rate of rupees 20 per meter square find number 1 inner curved surface area of the vessel number 2 radius of the base and number 3 capacity of the vessel we are given a cylindrical vessel with height 10 meter let us consider h stands for the height of the cylindrical vessel we are given that the total cost of painting its inner curved surface is rupees 2200 so total cost of painting is rupees 2200 where rate of the painting is rupees 20 per meter square so let us assume that its curved surface area is equal to x meter square so we have assumed that curved surface area of this cylindrical vessel is x meter square now once again the rate of painting of 1 meter square is rupees 20 20 so we can say that painting of area 1 meter square requires rupees 20 okay so we can say that painting of area x meter square requires rupees 20 multiplied by x or in another word you can say rupees 20x so painting of its curved surface area costs rupees 20x but according to the question the total cost is rupees 2200 so combining these two facts we can say that rupees 2200 is equal to rupees 20x so in this way we will get a linear equation it is 20x is equal to 2200 after solving this equation you will get x is equal to 110 so we have found that curved surface area of this cylindrical vessel is 110 meter square so first part is over look at the second part in the second part we are to find radius of the base let us assume radius of the base is r meter we have found the value of curved surface area we are given the height of this cylinder and we are to find radius of the base so according to the formula curved surface area of the cylinder is 2 pi r h where r stands for the radius and h stands for the height of this cylinder after substituting the values we will get curved surface area 110 meter square is equal to 2 pi is 22 by 7 radius r we are to find this and height is 10 so it is 110 is equal to 440 by 7 multiplied by r this is again a linear equation in variable r so after calculation we will get 100, 110 multiplied by 7 divided by 440 you will get the value of r is 7 by 4 it is 1.75 so you can say radius of the base of the cylinder is 7 by 4 
meter or 1.75 meter so in the third part we are to find the capacity of the vessel capacity of the vessel bin we are to find volume of this cylinder we know that volume of a cylinder is pi r square h where r is for radius and h is for height it is 22 by 7 radius square it is 7 by 4 7 by 4 height it is given to us it is 10 meter so after calculation you will get 96.25 meter cube we know that 1 meter cube is equal to 1 kiloliter so you can say that it is 96.25 kiloliter so capacity of the cylindrical vessel is 96.25 kiloliter 